The Bible says, In the ill-favored and lean-fleshed kind did eat up the seven well-favored and fat kind. So Pharaoh awoke. In this passage and in this chapter, Joseph interprets Pharaoh's dream. He tells of the seven coming good years and then the seven bad years that would come after that. And brethren, lean times may be coming. They may be coming because of your own personal sin. The Bible says in Psalm 106, 15, And he gave them their request, but sent leanness into their soul. If you are wrapped up in your own desires and wants, the request that you make to God will just result in leanness when God answers them. But if you delight yourself in the Lord, he shall give thee the desires of thine heart, as Psalms 37, 4 says. Job 8, 13 through 15 talks about those who forget God, and they are like those who lean upon their house, but it shall not stand, and that it says that he shall hold it fast, but it shall not endure. If you are forgetting God in your life, you are going to bring leanness into your own life. But who knows, there may be leanness happening in this world with everything that's going on right now. There may be leanness coming. But either way, we should do as Proverbs 3, 5 through 6 says, Trust in the Lord with all thine heart, and lean not unto thine own understanding. In all thy ways acknowledge him, and he shall direct thy paths. Lean this may be coming. It may be coming in your own life. It may be coming in this world. But brother or sister today, lean on God, and he will direct your path. He will keep you safe. He will protect you. And if anything else happens, you will end up in heaven one day where you can lean upon the breast of the Lord Jesus Christ for all eternity.